Hey, hey guys, it isn't Jim here. <laughs> no, guys, it's just me. <laughs> hey guys, it's me, Jake. Uh, here I have a sawed off shotgun. Um, does anybody remember my first shell ejecting shotgun build? That was the my first shell ejecting pump action shotgun build that I made on on the channel. Well, this is basically that. Far, far smaller. Uh, it's supposed to be sawed off, so I made the handle sort of a rifle grip, grip, grip only, pump action. And it holds two shells, just like my first shell ejecting shotgun. One in the, ch one in the tube, and one in the chamber. Sadly, it is fragile because uh, it's a pretty thin connection, but it works good. Well, good enough, I should say. This is really hard to do. I mean, as you can see, there's only a stud of between each shell, so it's really hard to fit in something stable. And also, to try and make one that loads in the bottom, I use my Ithaca system. Just scaled up. They're not scaled up, but added with the normal shotgun receiver. Receiver, excuse me. But yeah, trigger doesn't move because it. I had no room, but I. Oh well. Oh shoot! It. My hand was getting tired of that, holding it at that angle. Oh, see, we had a we had a jam, jam. That piece breaks off. I mean, at least you guys can see the technique. Also, pro tip: if you're planning on making a shell ejecting shotgun, making it bi big, or at least giving it a big mag tube would help. Well, I'm sorry that that shooting scene was short. I, I just wish this gun is really fragile, but it, it, in my opinion, it looks really good. Or, I mean, not really good, but pretty good. And reminds me of the sawed off shotgun from Enter the Gungeon, cause some, cause usually when you pump it, both shells fly out. Because in that game, whenever you reload a shotgun, you just pump once and shells go flying everywhere. In all directions. All at once. Like, eight shells at once. Oh well. I guess I will see you guys next time with a build that has been driving me insane. But it is so close to being done. It, it is probably... Something that I will remember for a long, long time. Bye-bye.